We notice that one of our BGP peer is advertising large number of routes causing instability in your network. How would you handle this situation to maintain this stability? It's very simple. To control like what routes can be accepted by the router in Border Gateway Protocol, we can use variety of like routing policies. So to control this problem, to you know fix this problem, what we are going to do with that particular neighbor, let's say for example, the neighbor is router number one. Let's say the router number one is advertising large amount of routes to router number two. What we can do here, we can implement variety of policies on router number two in inbound direction. If we have the access to router number one, we could have applied the policy in the outbound direction as well. But since considering that we don't have the access to router number one, because it is on the remote end, we have the access of the router number two. What we can do, we can apply a variety of routing policies in the inbound direction. In this policy, we can filter, we can use these route filtering policy to control like what prefixes are accepted and what prefixes are not accepted by the router. So in the route filtering policy, we can we can use things such as ACL, we can use things such as prefix list, we can use AS path access control list, we can use community list, we can use route map, we can use variety of techniques to perform the route filtering. So what we are going to do, let's say, for example, we are going to use the prefix list. So we are going to match the desired prefixes. We are going to accept those prefixes and I'm going to block the rest of them. And then we are going to apply this prefix list in the inbound direction with that neighbor point of view. So when this neighbor advertises the prefixes, route filtering will take place and except for all the prefixes that we want to receive, the rest of the prefixes are going to be blocked. We could have also used things such as, for example, ASPath ACL to control like what certain prefixes. Prefixes with these ASs in the ASPath list are accepted and other than all the prefixes are going to be blocked. So to, con uh, it's easy, like, to control this, to control what routes can be accepted or not, we can implement these routing policies. It, specifically, we are going to implement this route filtering policy. In this route filtering policy, what we are going to do, we are going to control, we are going to permit all the our desired prefixes and we are going to deny all the rest of the prefixes. Right? That we can do. Once done, once we have implemented all these policies, do not forget to monitor. Do not forget to monitor and optimize again to validate, like, you know what? Uh, so once we have applied the policy, monitor, use the validity of commands such as swipe BGP summary, swipe BGP all, you know, use those commands to check if all the routes that we wanted to receive are available in the BGP table and in the routing table. If the routes are not available, then change, change the ACL, change the prefix list, do the necessary changes in the access list or prefix list to control what routes are to be accepted, right? So once we have applied all that, don't forget to monitor the BGP table and the routing table to confirm that the desired routes are available. Also, like whatever traffic is being sent or received, you can also influence the outgoing or incoming data, again, using the same policies that we have discussed in the previous recordings. So we can implement like variety of policies to influence like uh, incoming or outgoing traffic. We can implement those policies to control what how the traffic exits or enters in our autonomous system. Right, so generally what we are going to do to control what routes are can be accepted or not, we can implement these routing policies. These policies can be applied in the inbound direction or the outbound direction. But since we wanted to do everything at our end, we are going to apply these policies at our end. Only. So these, this is this is like, you know, how to filter. We can use the filtering based on like these different, different routing policies.